Good day, beloved. Our reading is from 2 Samuel 23, verse 1. These are the last words of David, the inspired utterance of David's son, of Jesse, the utterance of a man exalted by the Most High, the man anointed by God, by the God of Jacob, the hero of Israel's songs. This is the word of the Lord. Thank you. Brothers and sisters, we're talking about David, a branch out of the root of Jesse, highly exalted and chosen from among the people, anointed to be a prophet, a priest, and a king. The man who raised up on high from a low estate to a high one, from the sheepfold to the throne, to be the king of all the tribes of Israel, who will ultimately pave way for our King Jesus Christ. Brethren, we've just had our municipal elections. Our country has been gripped by uncertainty, fear, looting, unemployment and we begin to wonder if our leaders have the morality and the integrity to run the country. Did we seek God's direction when casting the votes for our party leaders? Do our leaders really know God privately and intimately ultimately God is on the throne and he's the ultimate king yes we have chosen the leaders but those are earthly rulers and that's just that they're about power they're about numbers they're about popularity and not about stewardship and servitude We need to really think hard about who we vote for. Given the current situation, we have to start really trusting God and seeking His face and praying for our leaders. This is a new frontier. This is the time that we need to start thinking hard about our country and the unemployment gripping the country. We have to start choosing our leaders wisely. And it's all in our power and through the Holy Spirit that we can find guidance. Let's pray. Lord, we thank you for your word. Lord, we thank you for who you are. We ask, Lord, that you may please Work in our new leaders, their hearts, their, their minds. Lord, we pray that you may give them wisdom and understanding 
so that they can lead us and work with us. We thank you for new councillors that will be elected in the front wards. Be with them, Lord. Give them the wisdom and understanding. Help them also in, in, in their work, Lord. We pray for each and every person on earth, Lord, that you may guide and protect them. In Jesus' wonderful name, Amen. Jesus.